Hi, everyone. So also when we're adding or subtracting fractions, we need to think of trying to find the lowest common denominator, LCD, okay? Now that is the smallest number that the smallest multiple of 12 and 8, right? So we're thinking, what is the smallest multiple of 12 and 8? So one way to do that is to list the multiples of each number. So like 12, 24, 36, 48, and so on, right? We won't go too far. And then list the multiples of 8. 8, 16, 24, right? 32, 40, and so on, right? And actually, that goes to 48. So what, what I mean by the lowest common multiple is, like, 48 is a multiple of 12 and 8, but so is 24. And 24 is the smallest number that is a multiple of both 12 and 8, right? So we found our lowest common denominator. We're going to have 20 fourths on the bottom, right? Turn each fraction into 20 fourths. So then we think, what do I need to multiply by to turn this into 20 fourths, right? So in other words, what times 12 gives 24, right? So 2 times 12 gives 24. So multiply the top and bottom by 2, so we get 10 24 so 5 twelfths has become 10 24 it's the same quantity but it just looks different right different type of fraction so 3 eighths you've got to multiply by 8 by what to get 24 so 3 on the top and bottom right so so the 3 eighths becomes 3 times 3, 9 20 fourths. So we have 10 20 fourths plus 9 20 fourths, and if we add them, that's 19 20 fourths. And can we simplify this? We can't simplify this further, so that's our final answer there, right?